steps were going into my speech, you know, the traction would change a little bit, and Jason was running hard tonight, and there's no doubt about that. Did you think your shot to get him was a lap track? Yeah, in the open, open road, he was, he was as good or better than we were. I was just trying different lines, knowing that eventually we get the traffic and uh, trying to know where where I could couldn't go. And obviously, you have a big advantage doing that in second place, um, you know, before you get there. Because, you know, when you're in the lead, you just want to stay out and keep running. But uh, you guys did a great job. You know, turned out to work. So it was, it was still the steel lap and concrete. He's near Bouncing. So he's still last week. Max uh, was rolling pretty good, you know. We um, obviously, like you know, we were very, very tight in the qualifying race, and um, just kind of had to work on it, massage a little bit. And, uh, you guys did a really nice job getting this thing rolling around. I'll tell you what, you know, you've, you've been able to win a lot of features in your career. You look really relieved when you pull into Victor Wayne here. I mean, you haven't won, won here in a long time, and like I said, it's always special when you're in town. How about this crowd on Wednesday night? I'll tell you what, good answer is more than that. Yeah, you really could. We appreciate everybody being here. I know it's uh, sometimes it's a big track from uh, you know Pennsylvania way to come down. Appreciate all the people from uh, Maryland coming to this race, and even I saw West Virginia pit tags out in the. Out in the uh, out in the parking lot. So, I mean, we were really proud to be able to stand up here uh, and uh, you know, get the victory. Obviously, they're very, very difficult to come by, like I said. Haven't won here in a few years, so it feels really good to be able to come out here and uh, get one done. Well, how about this, this uh, Pennsylvania Speed Week series? You know, four races, now four different winners. Yeah, the competition level in this division is just is unbelievable. I mean, there's, there's 10 or 12 guys that went on any given night. The starting spot is so commercial. You know, the track conditions were a little tricky tonight. I've said before, but there was a top, there was a bottom, there was a middle, so you kind of move around to see where you were the best. Yeah, there was. It got wide. I mean, it was a little, uh, a little unforgiving and qualified. Obviously, going out early helped us tremendously because uh, the track just went away. I mean, we weren't very good. When we went out, we were a couple tenths off where we should have been, so we could have been back in the other and really, really bad shape. Fortunately, we got the race barely. And, uh, you know, again, the track wide now is where it was an excellent race. And you could run on the outside of somebody off the right rear, run on top, you could run on the bottom. I mean, it made for a very, very exciting race, hopefully, for you guys and uh, for us for four hours. <laughs> no doubt about it. Well, I know tomorrow night we go to one of your front race tracks, Four Bowl Speedway. I know you run well up there. So, good luck tomorrow night. Maybe you make it to it. I hope so. We're going to do the best we can. Yeah, we appreciate everybody coming out. Hope you had a great time and hope to see you uh, the rest of the week also. Already fans, he is your winner. Tonight's 410 Sprint Car Speed Week Series winner here at the Hagerstown Speedway. Let's give a big round of applause for Craig Hodnett.